What's up everybody, Tommy Ruff here, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. So, last episode we, uh, we sort of explored around Kakariko Village and all that, um, did a few things there, um, and I said that I would, uh, I said that off screen I would come here, so here I am. <laughs> I did a few things off screen, but um, nothing too major. So, um... You know, that the uh, the Great Fairy nearby and the musical troopers here. So um, yeah, um, yeah, this uh guy with the drum, I actually uh, found it by complete random uh over here like, w where you find um where you, where you find the uh, Hester's maracas in Breath of the Wild. Um, you do need you do need a uh, three quarter B honey though, which um, good thing good thing I was uh, good thing I was uh, collecting those, so uh, that's good. Um. So let's see what they need this time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yep. So he's got eight old beats, because of course he is. Yeah, yeah. Yep, there's another great fairy here. Yep, so I guess we have to get, get, have to get him uh, over there somehow, so. And the bridge is broken as well, so. So, uh, I, guess, I guess we're going to have to help them get across the river with a boat, probably. <laughs> Uh, all right, let's uh, see how this will work. Okay. Hmm, so what do we have over here? So I see some wood and all that. That looks like a battery. Okay, got some good trolls here as well, that's good. I'll take the fan. Sorry. I'll grab the battery, because why not? Might as well. This other fan I'll take. Um, and a large plank of wood. Whoops, sod up. Ah. Good enough. Okay, so put one there. One here. Hmm. Let me push this a bit further back. So that I actually have space for this. Okay, and now for the battery. Quite what I had in mind. I'm curious if that will still work. Hmm. 
But uh, point is... That should, in fact, work. Uh, we'll see, though. Right. So then, ah, god damn it! Ah, hold up. If I if I touch the front, now I can use it. Okay. So yeah. <laughs> Look how low the water he is. <laughs> so that actually worked. Hell yeah. And it is the uh, first great fairy you encounter from Breath of the Wild. So now we can upgrade our armor um, two levels now. Silver Rupee, yeah. Thank you. So yeah, there's only uh, two fairies left, so I assume there's uh, only uh, two uh, band members left. I think I know. Where, I think I um, have a clue on one of them because I heard something from a different from a, diff from a different stable, but um, yeah. Okay, can we actually, um... Oh, we can upgrade this as well. Wait. Hmm. Oh, I am one blue cobble horn short there. Um, for a full set at least. Alright, now I need Lionel parts. Um. Yeah, thankfully, um, I wear the Barbarian up over this, so, um, I only need, uh, ten... Oh, that's right, yeah, it costs money. So, it's t so 10 for level 1, 50 for level 2, so it's going to keep going up then. If it's 1,000 for level 4, I wouldn't be surprised. Okay, so a winnowing butterfly is an ice breath with Alpha's horns for that. Oh yeah, I forgot this can be upgraded. Um, oh yeah, that reminds me. <laughs> so yeah, I got I got you know, I got a stuff stuff I got in a, um stuff I've been off screen. The way I got it though <laughs> was absolutely amazing, guy. <laughs> um, I actually like I, I um recorded it so um. I'll, I'll, I'll put it. Uh, I'll put it. Um, I'll, I'll just show, show it to you and show the clip to you now. So, um.
Yeah, that was, uh, that was actually um, quite interesting. Um, Alright, upgrade this, because uh, why not? Alright, um... Frox fangs and dark clumps. So yeah, I, I didn't catch a, or say cat. I saw it didn't actually, um, it didn't see me, so yeah, what a large fox looks like. I'm pretty certain it's a, it is a, it is a uh, overworld boss, so, because they are big. Uh, so dark clumps shouldn't be too hard to get. Um, sad for another time. So, uh, okay then. Mm. Ah. <laughs> well, uh, there's that covered. Uh, but now, while I'm over here, there is something I want to check, though. Because now that, now that, um, like, caves, the pro proper caves have been introduced, I guess. Um, how, I just have a the suspicion there's going to be like at least one over here. Because there was a like, um. Oh, actually, hold up. Speaking of uh, blue cobble horns earlier. Are we taking this? <laughs> Just get his little buddy. Um. Why not? I just thought they can uh, ram you now because of the horns. Oh, he's a. Uh, what are they called? Evermeans? I'm going to try and get, like, hopefully get a, a picture of one for the compendium. So, uh... Didn't, didn't, didn't see the river there. Oh, there's multiple. That one has, um, okay. Do I have, like, um, an axe weapon? Will this work? Don't think it will. I will. I think they got them off. Well, that was something. A giant boomerang. Okay. Oh, yeah, I've got. I think I've already got a picture of that, yep. Sweet. Okay, uh, let us uh, continue, up, continue up this way, I guess. Um, yeah, because I think I was going to finish some black playing, so, um. Because in Breath of the Wild, there was the. Uh, um, so the uh, side quest um, related to the uh, bandit, which had a sort of cave at the top of the waterfall. Then there was also one nearby for a uh, shrine. So, uh, yeah, just a uh, feel right check just in case, because why not?
Oh, you got those two of them. I saw this um back at the uh, back at the uh, stable. Let's try and figure out what the point is here. Like, if you know, if if anyone knows what you're meant to do with these, um, please let me know. Stamina. I see a cave. That is a cave. That is a bigger cave. Looks like the, looks like the entire back hall was blown out. Um, I haven't got one for black recoppers, have I? No, I haven't. So, colorless dripping, I assume fire isn't an option. Maybe? <laughs> and up there we go. Okay, so clearly we have to make a vehicle. What up? Don't think I don't see you. Right, ultra hand time, I guess. Slap on an um, extra battery. And uh let us go. Well is it come on? Oh yeah. Witness me. That was amazing. Oh, I see why we need the, uh... Yep. Well, I probably see why we need them now. Turn in. We can just say um, F you to the defences. Or at least um, until we get stuck. Don't mo oh. Right, let's just uh, take that. Let's try this again. Yep. 
Oh, a royal shield. Um, hell yeah. Not getting that. What up, uh, Ultra Hand? Better. I can't remember. I can't remember. It's like a veritable tank. So uh, there's a cannon. There's some rocket power. He's got more batteries. But Another cannon. I'll take that. And with that, I uh, think that's probably enough for now. That's amazing. Okay, so what if we remove the cannons? Uh, let me heal up first, though. Um, eh, good enough. Yeah, okay, so, uh, rocket, rocket power was needed, but, um, at least we have a lot of, uh, batteries now. Hold up, or... That. And further into the cave we go. There's something here. Hold up.
Oh, um, Luna Stone. I think I need a... F yep. That should be the uh, last thing I need for the uh, treasure part of the compendium, at least. I'll be taking those. Oh, I didn't even break this, did I? Yeah, selling luminous stones is a, is a good, good way to make some money. Hold up. Okay, so what exactly is this? Well, anyway, um... So, whereabouts are we, uh... Ah, so we got we went underneath our Mount Floria, right? Yeah. Okay, so we're we're heading to um, yeah. Okay then. Now that was only the uh, first battery. Well, um, that's great. There's a spring. Get on in. Now there are more batteries. Um, got a strong contract boy. Okay, it's not gonna work. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, there's a ladder here for you. Um, why not? around yeah sweet and back to our unit coming through never mind Bang. All right, um, I'm definitely, I'm definitely taking the night shield. 
That's for damn sure. Um, goodbye, uh, soldier shield. Well, there's the uh, bubble frog. think we've made our point. Uh, now I did see a, uh, another way, th um, what the hell, wrong one, like another route to go. So uh, let's uh, add more batteries first. Oh there's, oh, there's a chest here. Star Fragment! There's a Star Fragment in that! Hell to the frick, yeah! So we can't go faster than, oh, oh, I see some arrows. I'm stopping this a lot, but I want to get, I want to get some stuff, so obviously I'm going to stop it. Wait, hold up. Of course. We have a spring. Chest. What awaits us here? Good enough. Onward, my absolute unit. Yeah, that path over there is all, is all thinking of, so... And I didn't take you out, just right. Do hedges just do, like, extra damage now or something? And here's all the parts to uh, make it on this side, I guess. Well then. So uh, we're behind the. Uh, yeah, okay, there's there, uh, actually a shrine here. So. Hmm. Don't feel like risking that. So um. Well. Um. Thank you, absolute. Thank you to my absolute unit for um, getting into that cave. Uh, let me uh. Get this real quick. Uh, 
and now I will be leaving. Um, now I will, I will come back in a sec, but before I, before I do that, um, while I think of it, I now have enough to get the uh, full snow cool armor set. So I intend I intend to buy that now before I forget, because I want to I want to do that on camera at least. And Gil, I'll be taking uh, this entire set now. See ya. So um, that, should, that should definitely help out when I eventually, eventually do the uh, Ritter quest line, which um, I will do eventually. I, I have postponed it quite a bit, but um, I want to at least get to a Tenno first. And I will probably die of the armor. I'll die at the exact same color as I do in Breath of the Wild. I haven't, I haven't thought about the all the new armor though, so um, yeah. It's going to be really interesting trying to uh, dye the Hylian armor though, because I, I do each set, each um, part of it a different color. Might, might, might just leave the Barbarian armor as is actually. Okay, so the tower is on top of Mount, of Mount Lanayru. Absolutely wonderful. Oh yeah, there, there's the Great Spring. Right. So now... Yep, I will, um... Yep. Just, I'll probably just, like, um... Ride the horse over then. Should be simple enough. Hello. Take course. I'll be taking uh she <laughs> Which one do I want to take actually? Yeah, it's good. Let's, let's take Spectria. Why not? Probably would have taken a bit, would have been a bit oh. idea to take um ah. and remove the harness oh. for now. I don't intend to use it um right now. Oh. Ah. Oh. Ah. <sighs> and let us um go. <laughs> so um, I'll probably cut to like to um. I actually get that in a village because um, I don't really recall there being um, anything interesting along the way there. So um, like if there if there is, um, I'll let, I'll um, show it. But um, yeah, I think I'll just uh, cut to when I get there. And we are, have arrived at what, at what looks like the Mushroom Kingdom of all things. Why are there all, so many mushrooms? And while I think about it, um... The house is over here. What up? Okay, nah, looks like it's uh, looks like someone has taken it now. Wait, no. Hey. <laughs> guess it's just re guess it's just uh, renovated. I guess. So you got rid of all the. Uh, let's see, because like, oh, see, yeah. it's got the uh, got the um, champion's bard uh, picture there. That's nice.
Okay. After calamity, I asked myself how to rebuild. I said, I got the title answers. The city is okay. Do to school in a town of village. It's the largest Highland village. Um, yeah, that's that is definitely true. Oh, Simeon, he, is he the teacher there? <laughs> okay. Yeah, he persisted for years, which makes him well well equipped to deal with um, <laughs> well equipped to deal with the needs of quirky children. That is amazing. <laughs> Um, Christian Bolson, who taught um, his trade to Hudson of Hudson Constructions to construct a school for us, did, did, did the request. This will be his uh, final job in attendant before he sets off on a journey. So that's why Hudson's in charge now. I had him add a secret. Hold up. Had him add a secret room to my house, one that won't appear on the plans. It's steam, um, it's steam by humid humidity and temper control so it's very comfortable it's proven very useful when i'm working alone and need to concentrate the school has been um moving along smoothly but a major problem recently uh, reared its head we don't have enough teachers so we need to be people okay ah right well, uh, guess we're gonna have to try and find this uh, hidden room now. Hmm. Oh, the well. I have this is here as well. We can finally enter this now. But um, is that what a secret well? In here. Well worn hairband. Okay. Another diary. How's it, man? No, no matter no matter where I go to um off aid, Link remains at my side. A kind of that has um taken a visible toll on his clothing. Um that's why I put an order in for a new and improved champion tunic, just for him. Why, thank you. Can I get it? Can't see the look on his own face when I surprise him with it. Oh, come on. I'll put it in the throne room so he won't find it until after our investigation. Um, even he would never expect that torches are the key. Uh, I think you'd be surprised, but... um. This, this is a clever way of um, finding this out, um, because I think you couldn't you couldn't even enter the throne room in Breath of the Wild. It wasn't until I do Calamity where we actually go into it, but um, I guess we can in this game. That's good. So, yeah, I showed it like obviously it's safe to enter like the part of the part of the castle that isn't floating, but um. Right. Anyway, I I think we'll actually end this episode here because um the recording's been a bit, a fair bit longer and I'll have a bit to cut out. So um yeah, I think we'll end, end this here and explore the rest of, rest of the tenor in the next episode. So uh thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. See ya.